<laughs> Guys, I'm playing Starfield. Look at that. New. Yes. <laughs> I'm so excited. To the stars and beyond. Argos Extractor's Mining Outpost, Moon of Vectera. That's very close. Hello? Seals are good. Oxygen's good. Just do what you did last time and you're fine. Follow my one simple rule. Hella, what's my one simple rule? Listen to Lynn. Boss lady knows best. <laughs> exactly. Listen to me. Mining's just like any other job. Go steady, go safe, go home with a pocket full of credits at the hmm. end of the day. Okay. Yeah, totally. It's just like, um, now I work in the Star Dock, except uh, with more cave-ins, lasers, and accidental dismemberment. Okay. Very helpful. Thank you. Ah, you're gonna be fine. Your first outing was solid. And, you know, let's be honest, it ain't exactly astrophysics. That's why I keep him around. Good pep talks. <laughs> yeah. And the fact that I can pinpoint a helium deposit from 300 meters. <laughs> Not untrue. A shame we won't find any down here. But the metal deposits alone should pay for our own helium. Hell, after this, we'll have enough jump fuel to bounce from one end of the settled systems to the next. Hey, more minerals, more money. And so the cycle repeats itself. Just no more unauthorized jumps in a house for room space, okay? He's just a big baby. There are worse lives. You know, most Dusties don't even make it this far. I have a good feeling about you. Dusties. Right, group hug now or at the end of the shift? Now! Uh, one of these days, Hella, I am going to leave you behind. <laughs> you just want hugs. Promises. Nice. I love how this looks so good, but still looks like a Bethesda game, if you know what I mean. Okay, let's see what we've got. One small step. For mankind. Uh, Grab some samples. Always. Uh, but not you. Check on Isabel. Make sure she eases up on the breach. I don't feel like getting buried alive today. Roger that. Remember, Dusty. Keep your breathing steady. And never take that helmet off down here. Never. Oxygen processors don't extend this far. Yeah. Because God forbid we drill on a rock with breathable atmosphere. Know what I love about working in Freestar Collective Space? Fewer regs. A job like this in the United Colonies? Huh. Reams of red tape. Welcome everybody to Starfield! I've been waiting for this for a long time. I bet you all have too. And I'm super excited to play this, finally. I've been growing up with Bethesda games. My first game and my first RPG ever was Morrowind, so Bethesda games are dear my heart. I know they're buggy sometimes, but that's just adding to the charm in my opinion. Bethesda, thank you very much for sending me a key. I appreciate you, that's awesome sauce. And yeah, let's let's just dive right in. <laughs> Can't talk. Anybody else just being able to speak gibberish once they like had very little sleep? It's just like, meh. <laughs> How do you like the game so far? Yeah, I mean, the, what was it, two minute intro just was awesome. Love it. <laughs> it was great. Good game. Game of the year. Supervisor Lin. This individual is busy. Okay. How Starfield? Best game of the year, guys. This is, by the way, guys, we j just got off the elevator. I love it. I love people. <laughs> I love you people. Twitch chat is awesome. You, you start the gameplay one minute of the game and everybody's like, How's the game? <laughs> ah, you guys. Minor. Uh, you think we'll be done here soon? Now I hear this is the last dig. I don't know. I have no idea. I just got here. Do you have access to the full game as a limited streamer edition? Full game. This one over here. Calvert! No! Ah, no, no, no! It's a laser, not a sledgehammer! <laughs> Ease up! Benning, if you 
got paid per break, you'd be a millionaire. Let's go. Yeah, yeah, okay. What do we say, Dusty? You make your cut, you get your cut. No exceptions. Come on, pick it up. Troy, what's the yield? Minimal at this point. Occasional glimmer, but it's weak. What do you think? Stay the course? No, ma'am. Juice ain't worth the squeeze. Well, what? okay then. Let's call this one tapped. Why don't you move over to that big vein we looked at? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Hi, Tyron. Rate the elevator out of ten, please. Uh, I would say it's a six out of nine, if you would... If I may. <laughs> Hi, Zelly Boba. Welcome in. Ooh, what's this? Oh, okay. Dusty, you're up. Grab a cutter and mine what you can. Metal deposits are in that cavern. I'll shout out when I need you. Yes, ma'am. All right, collect mineral deposits. Okay. I am a miner and I'm digging a hole. Dig a diggy hole. Diggy diggy hole. Am I doing it correctly? Razor cutting. Whee! That's fun. How they sucker you to join? Fall for the fancy. Thanks, family. guys. Witchy, thanks for the three month resub. Chonk, chonk, chonk. Thank you, Pancake, for the six month resub of Prime, guys. I appreciate you. Enjoy the emotes. Return to Supervisor Lin. Wow. I'm busy. I see that. Everyone What's this? Wee! Oh my Come god. On. I love how this Time. plays. You're with me. So much like any other Bethesda game, right? This feels exactly like playing Fallout 4, for example. Which I like. <laughs> Watching those mine minerals in the cave, hell yeah, on a different planet. Am I supposed to talk to you? Let Hella do his job. Yeah. yeah, this looks very delicate. Alright, uh, standard reading of clean break. Shut it down. Let's go. I hope I can make a character soon. Hella, get the readings. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, about that. Problem? Uh, not if you consider a spike in gravity readings a problem. I don't. Okay. You don't? What we're after? It'll read as an anomaly. That's what I was told anyway. Okay, now you're starting to freak me out. <laughs> Relax. It's just another job. Come on. Fallen for in space? Yeah. Ooh. We're getting close. I think. Oh. Yeah, Do I have something like a light? Oh man, I should stay close to them, but I want to explore! <laughs> okay, you. You're up. Something goes wrong in there, we'll come get you. Uh, explore the cave. Why would anything go wrong? Would you shut up? Both of you do your jobs. Client is on his way. Client? Uh-oh. So this is where I'm supposed to go, up there, to the, to the sexy gone. We're going down this way. And probably meet something like the equivalent of a death claw and then insta death. But you know, there might be some cool stuff down here, so let's go. Man, it's so dark. If there would be a massive hole in the ground, I would just fall to my doom. Just like that. I'm stuck. Ah, there you go. <laughs> uh, gosh, this is dark. This is advanced darkness, chat. A hot tub. Okay. Hold F to turn off flash. You tell me this now, game. <laughs> I would have needed it down there, you know. All right. Ooh, fancy. Um, still getting weird gravity readings. I, I guess that's a good thing. Just keep going. Okay. Why are we yelling? Do you see anything? 
Oh god. You mean to tell me 200 years in the future they still have shitty audio like this? God damn. Uh oh. Am I gonna- am I gonna melt if I step into this? Please no. Ooh. Break the deposits, explore. Am I... doing this? Um, what? <laughs> what? Let me sleep. <laughs> nice. That was nice. Hey, come on. Come on. Okay, take it easy. You were out cold. Uh, no physical damage. Mentally, the jury's still out. You Excuse know me? Who you are? New recruit for Argos Extractors? Ring any bells? Any of this look familiar? <gasps> Carry decoration! <laughs> All right, chat, let's go. Uh, hey, Liz, thank you for the 17 month resub. How are you? Thank you so much. Hi, Cloud. Welcome in, everyone. Hope you're doing good. Guys, what is. Oh, this is cool. This looks like a DNA sequencer, right? Oh, look at you. You're cute. Okay, chat, question. What character are we making? Are we trying to make something that looks remotely like me? Or are we just making anybody? Or what are we doing? <laughs> Liz, hey you, you're finally awake. <laughs> oh, we could make a grandma. Let's make a list, making list in space. Spaceless? Okay. Okay. They have a lot of presets. How many presets do we have? Let's make a Geralt. Let's make Danny DeVito. Whoa! Wait, how can I... Can I rotate you? Ma mouse 2. Uh, okay. Ooh oh, you can zoom in as well. Damn, this is already getting in this in the cyberpunk mood, right? No, oh, that little ponytail. <laughs> Forty. Forty presets. Okay. I don't know. Maybe this is a relatively good base. Like from the face shape in general, maybe. I don't know how... How... Uh... Oh, this is like an... Oh, we can make a chunky. Make her super ribbed. Like a super, super ribbed spaceless. Bam. Maybe more like, I don't know, more like, more like this. <laughs> Welcome in, everybody. Listen, space, please. Okay, Clarice. No, Romsey, sorry. <laughs> Enjoy your food, King. Oh! Body type. Ah, okay. Mm hmm. Walk style. Oh. <gasps> I see. Okay. This is nice. I like that. Usually they just always have the same walk, right? Skin tone. Okay. Do they have chalk? Because that's my skin tone. 
Is it the lighting or are the legs just like way more tanned? <laughs> Strong space. I guess I'm pretty pale, right? Maybe, maybe, maybe two. Okay, cool. Um, face. Here we go. Oh, she has freckles. I love that. Skin tone again, and the face can have a different skin tone, or, or what? Yeah, like this head sh head shape. Boop, 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 boop. I'm gonna play around with this so much. I don't know. I think this was okay. Like 50 shades of white as always. <laughs> uh, they should work on the beards in this game. They don't look like hair. What do they look like? Giga chat. <laughs> Just like. I guess that is fine ish. I have a pretty square shaped face, I think. Hair color. Can I do stuff like the eyes and, and such? Oh, there you go. Um. Um. And can I tilt them as well? I color it. Ooh. Bruh. Okay, I have hazel eyes, like dark green. So let's see if they have dark green eyes. Oh god, this looks so cool but so creepy as well. I guess I just gotta go with like this this greenish tone. Hmm. Uh, if people want to make themselves, Bethesda should have added a tool where you could upload a picture of your face and it would try to match it. That's not a bad idea. Do you think that's easily possible? Oh god, these 2,000 eyebrows. <laughs> um, I kind of like the one with the cut. It's just not really me, right? Maybe this. I guess this is the closest to mine. Eyebrow color. Okay, you have lots of freedom in here. I like that. Vitato! Thank you for the first time sub on my channel, guys. We have a first time subscriber. Please welcome them. With lots of chunky chunks. Guys, um... Vitato, I make the emotes myself. I hope you like them. Is this black? Is this supposed to be black? You're missing the refine button on the options. What? I went with the Riddick eyes. Oh man, I had such a massive crush on Riddick as a kid. Young Vin Diesel, you know, with the silver eyes. <laughs> So cool. I only just got past the Baldur's Gate 3 character creator. No star field. Uh oh. <laughs> I think I think this is supposed to be black. I don't know. Forehead. Well. Well. I don't know, man. <laughs> uh, 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 I, I, <laughs> e for refine. Oh, is this like make like shaping it yourself a little bit, like like in Fallout Four, where you could hover over certain parts of the face and then you can like shape it, like just picking and then. <laughs> Turn around, we need to see your forehead. <laughs> is this okay? 
Aha, nose. That's very cute, but it's not my nose. Mm. All these cute noses. Boop. Now I have a I have a bigger nose. looks disgusted like I do not approve would be great if you had music here your forehead her forehead is way too forward yeah it's, yeah I'm not I'm not happy with it either yet can I maybe just like take the nose and just extend it is that possible uh-huh okay Nose tip down up. I think that is fine. Just like... No. I just want to take it and like... You know, like Pinocchio style. Back forward. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. Back forward, maybe. Oh boy. I hope you guys brought some tea and some snacks. Um, I don't know if this is close enough to my nose. What is- aha, uh -huh, okay. I guess this is fine. Although I would like to put the entire thing just down now. Like it's too high up right now, it needs to go down. Nothka, thank you very much for your prime sub. Enjoy the emotes, I make them myself. Nostrils and out, down- aha, down up! Oh, oh, Gifyanki. <laughs> Geek! Yeah, I guess. Now, where's my- where's the mouth stuff? Ears. I think I have relatively small ears. Gosh. Do you guys like custom- like, very, very, like, complex character customization or are you overwhelmed by it? I think I like the second. This one. Yeah, I love it. Complex, always. I mean, you could usually just go with, um, I don't know, a default, right? Cheeks. So she has very fallen in cheekbones. Mine are a bit more like... So, I hope we're talking about the cheeks in the face. <laughs> Can I make you a little bit more plum in the face? Her eyes give me Ellie vibes for some reason. Is it just the skin? I... Hmm. Well, that looks not so nice. Hope you brought some snacks, chat. Excuse us. This ain't for the first rodeo watching the beat the character creation boss. We are prepared. <laughs> Hi, Nofka. Welcome in. Thank you so much for giving me your prime sub of the month. Enjoy the emotes. If you're not getting stuck at the customer and the character customization for five hours you're not a true gamer <laughs> well i would say you are but some people just couldn't care less about character creation you know and i mean if i do hmm. how can i give you some more chubby cheeks can you can you do this? I guess it's more the skin tone, huh? Or like the, the, the general shape of it. I don't know. Mouth. Aha, uh -huh. okay. Oh my god, don't smile. <laughs> that scared me! <laughs> Why do they always
always make it super creepy when they smile. Like, <laughs> I was like, what's going on? No, I don't want that kind of mouth. Don't, don't, don't. Why? <laughs> Why? Bloody hell. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Um... Um... Maybe this? Moth number nine? Or this? Can I zoom onto her mouth? <laughs> this one looks like... I'm not gonna say a word! Nope. Oh wait, where's my camera all blurry? Focus. Why do you remind me so much of Ellie right now? Don't do that. What do you guys think, eight or nine? Eight, 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 nine, nine, eight, nine, six? No. <laughs> eight or nine? Oh god, you guys seem to be torn between eight and nine as well, right? Great. <sighs> Welcome in, by the way, everyone. Hello. Hi, Multi. I'll let you like eight? Just, you know, just... Why? This looks a bit tall, like... Hmm. I don't know. Let's go with nine. Uh, eight, nine, or ninety-eight? <laughs> Teeth, oh god. Oh lord. Girl, have you not been brushing your teeth? Too much candy. Okay, this looks like a bit... <laughs> this looks so weird, man. <laughs> Let's go with two. I guess. This is fine, right? I mean, she's not... Op she's like... Trying to show as little teeth as possible while smiling like a derp. derp. Jaw? Ooh. What am I gonna do with your jaw now? Giga Jet Jaw? Oh. Oh god. Um Video games never get my drawline right because I have like The echo is really bad. Not sure if it's not mm, sure. What? Echo? I think you might have my stream open twice. And that's why you have an echo? Thank you for lurking. Uh... I don't know. Tomato, tomato right now. I, I don't know. All right, eyes. We need to go back to the eyes and tilt them. Eye color, eyes, there you go. And then narrow wide. Uh, normal, I would say. Scale down up. Oh, like, oh, make them bigger. I think I have relatively big eyes. But I don't know. Back forward. Sorry, what? What does that do? Oh, like how far they're in the skull? Okay, I see. Um, maybe like this? 
down up. Okay, I think mine are relatively, like, I have a big forehead. Sunken or bulging, yeah. Welcome to the stream. Hello. Hi, Mazarov. Can you refine the eyes at all? Yeah, I think they're, like, tilted down and on the on the outer edges, and I would like to change that a bit. I don't know if I could. How many of you guys in chat do you just pick a preset character just to jump faster in the game? No, I always have to make my own character. Okay, the shape blends. Oh, what the heck? Gosh, these lashes though. What the heck is happening with this? Okay. What does this do? Something with the eyebrows? Hmm. Was it, was it number four? I don't know. I wish I could give her darker eyes, but it's not dark green. Oh wait, maybe with the color? Oh, it doesn't have refined sadness. Sadness. Hmm. Her mouth doesn't look symmetrical. I don't know why either. I don't know. <laughs> Hi, Poison. Welcome in. I didn't do that. The mouth it was like that when I got here. I promise. I wish they would have added some music here. Was that six? Yeah, okay, wait. What does seven do? I'm not so sure about that one. What does it really do? Hmm. Uh-huh. 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 Okay. Okay. Still, I cannot... I cannot take the eyes and... Or does anybody know how to do that? Take the eyes and... Right now they're like... Droopy on the outside, right? It's new to It's a forehead to me, it looks way too big. We can we can we're still it's still a work in progress, my friends. Maybe this? Is this better? Choose another eye set. <sighs> Why do they oh we all of them look like Like they're made out of play-doh and then they squish them around. One eye is always like weird. Have we been punched in the face as a kid or did we fall off the, the diaper making table where you like change the diapers and then the kid's just like, wee! What happened? What happened to you, love? That's the usual Bethesda face? Nah. They're usually very symmetrical, aren't they? It's just that this one eye and the one side of the mouth is just like a bit... <laughs> I don't know guys, I don't, I don't think any of the other eyes are better in that regard than the ones that we picked. They all have the tilt, like the tilt in the outer corners, no matter what I pick here. It's not getting better. Slight asymmetry in the face makes it look more realistic. Makes it also hard to like customize. Would be cool if you could pick that yourself if you want to have like an asymmetrical face. They don't make us. I'm not making fun of of loopy eyed people. I'm I'm just trying. I'm just trying to, like my eyes go more like straight or like even up, on the outer corners. And would you guys wanted me to make a, a kind of list character. So, so far I'm. I can't. I'm just a bit sketch. That's okay. We can just like try, right? 
close enough. Where's the mouth again? Are we... Hmm. Oh, mouth. Uh, j -j -j. Bloody hell. This is the same thing that I always had issues with in Fallout 4. You slide around and then it's just like... You slip off into another area and then you change everything all of a sudden. I guess you're not supposed to use the mouse that much when you do this. Underbite, oh. No, not really. What does this do? Oh, okay. <laughs> I wish. Nikolai wish. What does this do? What the heck is this? Why did they not name this? I feel like it gets worse. What is this supposed to be? What is it supposed to- what is six supposed to change? It changes everything else as well. How is that working? All my settings are gone again. What the heck? Okay, bloody hell. Change to six, what do you mean? Did you not see that all of these things were reset once I used number six? I don't know, guys. <laughs> this is this is getting difficult because all of a sudden, do you see how this just changed everything up here? Number eight as well. I think you get the average between the presets, fifty percent of blah blah. Okay. Hmm. Hi, Exo. Welcome in. I say start over. Start over what? <sighs> I hate that it, that one setting charges th changes another. It's so great that they are not labeled. I mean, it's just confusing that you set something and you don't know what you're gonna change when you use six, and then suddenly everything else is being reset again. Now she just looks like. I want her to be happy. Can I just go with? There you go. Um, I don't know, I guess this is good enough, right? Just put a helmet on! <laughs> Jaw, chin? Oh dear, okay. What is this? It's like two jaw thingies? Choo -choo. Oh man. Bruh, I don't know. Just like young girl's face, but then like, uh, what? <laughs> uh, Gosh, I don't know. Hmm. Neck. Just like, you use lots of anti-aging cream on your face, but you forgot your neck. <laughs> or like lots of sunscreen in the face, but then you forgot the neck. <laughs> mm. I don't know, this looks re realistic, right? Maybe like that. Jewelry! Alright. Buy me more jewelry! Oh, Pierce. Oh, oh. Okay. I used to have a piercing like this, the, the septum piercing. Aww, I like those. Actually, I have mine right here. <laughs> I 
I just imagine wearing a space helmet that could cause trouble, so maybe we just go with something small like this. There you go. I don't have freckles, but I do like her freckles. Jewelry color. Oh man. Okay, what is dermostatic? Is that something face? Derma face? Okay, there you go. Uh, uh, oh lord. Yeah, derma skin, but derma static. Hmm. Did you cry while you're getting your septum? My tears were running. Yeah, I wouldn't say I cried. I would just say the tears came running, yeah. Because the, the nerves of the, the nose and the eyes are connected, so you just like... It just keeps on running. What even is happening here? Yup. She she looks as sleepy as I feel right now, and I probably look as well. Aww, freckles and stuff. I wish I had freckles. I always wanted freckles. I don't really have like a down pointed nose. I don't know when that happened. Might have to go back into the nose section. Lack of coffee, definitely, yes. Mm hmm Aww. Little, bl little blush here. Airsick, thank you very much for giving me your prime sub. Enjoy the emotes. Appreciate you. I make the emotes myself. I hope you enjoy those. Welcome to the chonkies, guys. Please welcome a first time chonky chonk. Oh, bruh. I don't know. And thanks also for the follows, everyone. You can fake freckles anyway, that's true. Please tell me you have 69! Oh, five too short. Dang it. 47, you think? This was kind of cute, right? I don't know what this is supposed to be. I thought maybe it's... Uh, just like... Maybe from the cold of the space, her skin is a bit, like, sensitive here, or no? I don't know. Complexion color temperature. Dead. Orc. Too much Trump face color. I don't know. Uh, zombie. <laughs> this doesn't look too bad. A bit red, maybe. so dead <laughs> I don't know is it just my eyes or does she look super dead let's let's go with that all right what did I say I wanted to do um yes nose dum 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 finch finch Okay, so we zoom in. And then we do the... Uh, which one was it? Did we no. do the hair yet? Nope. Nope, we didn't do the hair yet. Hi, Elias, welcome in. How you doing? Yoo-hoo, it's September, it is. A tip needs to go down a bit. My, my, my tip is not really going down. It's just, like, longer. Hers is just flatter. My, my, my nose is longer. But I'm, I'm pretty much giving up on trying to make my own anyways. My own, my own nose, because the, sadly the, it's a bit too limited still. What does this do? Down, up, what? Ah, oh, yeah, okay. I just... 
Oh, this is nostrils. Okay. <laughs> if I change anything here again, I can restart with a bloody nose anyways, right? Maybe I need to try a different one. This, this would be too short. Wait, which one was it? Uh... On this pro mm. uh, uh. Oh man. And now. Uh, this maybe? And then make it wider. It's not the ridge, but. This? Oh no! It, the thing is, it says nose tip down. What what it what it does, guys? It's not pointing the nose tip. It's like literally the tip. It's just making a a bump on the nose, which I don't really have. So. Hi, Mediata. Hello. This reminds me taking like three hours in Baldur's Gate 3 character creation. Uh, I took 90 minutes. You know what? Screw this. I don't know. This is as good as it gets. I'm, if I mix anything here, everything will be messed up again. So we just like move on. Uh, where's the hair? Facial forms. Oh god, I thought we'd done with this. I just see now there's so much more. <laughs> All right, all right, all right, I got it. Uh -huh. Okay, so we were here. Uh-huh. Oh, this is cute. I love freckles, man. There's, oh, look at her. Ah. I'm sorry, I always, I always love freckles. I wish I had freckles. These are big freckles. I've never seen this big freckles. I just have a few and I have like um. Is it a mole here and then here? Maybe we just like give her a few, I don't know. Like 18 is good. Oh, well it needs to be here, but well. Okay, 22 is good. What the heck is that? What? What is that some space condition? Okay. Didn't expect that with complexions, but uh, do, 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 do. let's give her twenty two. That's fine. Scars. Arr. Holy crap. Ow, that looks painful. I suffer from sun freckles. They definitely show up more in this. I love freckles. I think they're so cute. Holy. I mean, I don't really have a scar in my face. Ow, oh God. Let's put a smile in that face. <laughs> Ooh. Lunity! Oh my god, you're you're blessing me with all these raids, love. Thank you so much. Sending some loony love. Hello, how are you? Lunity raid. Hello, Lunity. Thank you so much for raiding over. Welcome in, everybody. I hope you had a good time. Hello, hello. How's it going? Thank you so much for raiding over. Welcome in, everybody. If you don't know me, I'm Liz, a variety streamer from Germany. I'm living in Switzerland. We just finished Baldur's Gate 3 last stream, and today we're playing Starfield. Long waited for. Finally, it's here. I'm super hyped. Um, yeah, we're still stuck in character creation. <laughs> There's lots of options. Welcome in, everybody. It's nice to meet you. Hello. Facial forms. Oh my god, I'm gonna regret everything, right? 
Aha, it's aha, uh -huh, okay. Very chipped lips. Hi, Waffin. She can't have freckles and scars. <laughs> I don't think freckles just happen um, to somebody who never had freckles before. I wish I could. I wish I could have freckles. I love them. Perfect timing and finishing Baldur's Gate. Yeah! I mean, I did a bit of a longer stream on Wednesday, but I wanted to finish Baldur's Gate in time for this. I've been waiting for, for Starfield for, I don't know how long. A long time. You were playing Final Fantasy VII Remake, if I'm not wrong? I don't want to say anything wrong. Guys, if you don't know Lunity, please go check her out. She's a variety streamer. Usually plays games before me, so it's live before me. Um, was recently playing Zelda and uh, now Final Fantasy, if I'm not mistaken. And she's a she's a singer and she does like rock covers of of stuff and it's awesome. Facial forms too. What's the difference between those two? I'm confused. That's definitely how I feel today. <laughs> tattoos. No, I don't like tattoos. No, 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 no. Cheeks. Oh, I can give her a blush. Alright. Or less of a blush. Or a blush in a different location. Okay. And cheeks too? Aha. Uh -huh. Wait. Yeah, I like the blush more here. As you can see, I, I already have like red cheeks. <laughs> Oh god, lipstick base. Here here goes, chat, here goes the makeup stuff. I have no clue what I'm doing. <laughs> Hi Sophie, hello, welcome in. We finished Final Fantasy, Final Fantasy 7 remake recent Oh so I'm so sorry. You were playing Armored Core. Dang it. I'm so sorry. Okay guys, I'm I'm sorry I lied to you unintentionally. Um so Lunid is currently playing Armored Core. How do you like it? You probably hear that question all the time, right? Broken Survivor, thank you for the reset for 14 months. Guys, we have a sub -a No, not sub -a -thon, but we have a September event going on for the entire month with lots of golds. And we currently have a giveaway running still. So if you want to participate, uh, exclamation mark, I am Chonky in one, in one word. Everything put together. I am Chonky, not I'm. I am. And then you can join. Where was I? Lipstick. Um, lipstick accents. Oh my god, man. I have no idea. What What even is the difference? Everything looks the same to me. <laughs> Eyeshadow lower? No. Eyeliner. Oh yeah, eyeliner. I like eyeliner. Sheesh. Can we have like the the normal thing, just like the wing, the, you know, the pleb stuff that I do, because I have no clue about makeup and stuff. <laughs> Intensity one hundred, and then color. Give me black. Okay, this is cool, but it's just a bit dramatic. But is there a different type of eyeliner? No. Maybe just the very minimalistic one. Eyeliner lower? No. Wait. No. No eyeliner. Dirt. Dirty. <laughs> Welcome in everybody. Nice to meet you. Hello. I mean, we are a minor right now, so... Wait, did the eyeliner change again? Guys, what do you think? Two or three? The... the hardly visible eyeliner or this one <laughs> hi david two three three two three three <laughs> so this is two it looks like it almost it basically has none this this is none so the difference is not massive but it's teeny tiny so two or three i think three is a bit too much and i think two is a little bit too little so i w wish something in between would be nice Dark Mantis, thanks for 12 month resub. Welcome back. 
Two, two, two. <laughs> I love how Gia says three is too much. <laughs> and Gia, Gia has like lashes and less like. <laughs> like from all people in chat, you. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm not. I'm, this is not meant to bully you, but I just like. You're like the the makeup queen, right? <laughs> and it's just like that just made me chuckle a little bit. That eyeliner looks wonky. It does, especially because it's pointing downwards. I have no clue about makeup, but this is like pff, it needs to go up, lady. Come on, Bethesda, you need to you need to up your makeup game. Come on, you can do better. Okay, three, uh, two. We we take two. Dirt. Am I done? Okay, where's the hair? I haven't seen hair. Chat, where do we, where do we do body? Do we? No, I don't. I don't. I don't think I want to be dirty. Not. Not permanently. I want to do my hair. Chat, where do I do my hair? Biometric, body, face, background, traits. Traits? Background? Oh. Where do I do my hair? <laughs> Scroll. Hey. Hey. Oh, it was right in the beginning and I missed it. I just, I must have skipped it completely and then just forgot about it. Okay, thank you. Sorry. Uh, guys, I'm running on very little sleep for days now, just as my excuse here. My excuse that probably doesn't count. All right, how many hair, hair, hair types do we have? Oh, go oh, perfect. This is definitely my hair, right? Beautiful. Gorgeous. <laughs> Absolutely my hair type. Ooh. Crawl out through the fallout, baby. The eighties. Look at that. <laughs> this looks such. A, so, th th this is me if I would be a member in Alien. Yo, what the? <gasps> oh, I love that. Oh gosh. Now the question: Do they have my type of? Oh god. pixie okay this is the one that we had um 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 i'm not i'm not convinced yet chat i'm not convinced yet I'm not convinced. Absolutely not. Come on, game. Give me some, some hair where I'm like, BAM! This is the one that I want. You're the one that I want. Ooh, 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 yeah. Yup, that's, that's the one. <laughs> uh, will you ever play Zelda Tears of the Kingdom on stream? I don't have... Which platform is it? Is it Switch? I have no idea. I've never... I don't have the... The console for it and now don't come at me with emulating this is not legal crap what am i gonna do maybe maybe this is actually the best one i was hoping for some other stuff but oof. come on oof. this feels very 20s I mean, this is super cute. I wish I had curls, though. I don't have the straightest hair in history. It's just like, pfft, goes down like that. Boring as hell. Maybe we go crazy. <laughs> I mean, it's the future, right? <laughs> Although I kind of do like that. She looks so cute and innocent with that one. Switch? Yeah, no, I don't have a switch. This one? I don't know what's going on with that strand of hair that bothers me a bit. What what is that? Oh, she looks like she's she is going to Sunday school and church. Blech. And she's saying grace and dinner table, you know, that's not me. <laughs> this is fucking 80s and I love the 80s, so this is kind of cool. 
I mean, I've never seen the 80s, but I love the music. <sighs> she looks like the, the singer in the red sparkly dress in Fallout 4. I forgot her name. This is obviously the best one of all the haircuts. I mean, look at that. This is, th this is, this might be it, guys. Look, look at this. Isn't this pure perfection? Isn't this the most gorgeous specimen you've ever seen? Ever. <laughs> All right. Okay, for me, it's either this one. Just because it's not awful. Or this one, 35 or 38 for me personally. <laughs> I don't know why this the alien. I think I'm thinking of Ellen Ripley. I think she such, had such a haircut. It's hot. <laughs> Jekyll, I see a person of taste. Lorene-esque, Lorene-esque. Who's Lorene? Lorene, 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 Lorene. Should we do, should we do a poll? I mean, is this not gonna clip through the helmet? Hmm. Gosh, this is so freaking 80s. I can't get over it. Beauty is beyond compare. The one you started with was the best. Oh, I think that looked meh. I think it was 21 or 22. You mean this one? Mm. Nah. I don't know how much I'm gonna see my face anyways. Probably never because I'm playing first person. Also, we need to get the right hair color. Wow. Boom, okay. <laughs> okay, where's the... Where's the red-brown-ish? Guess this is as good as it gets. What? Like, do you see I have like a little bit of auburn hair? Like it's brown, but also a bit of red. Hmm. <laughs> Hey, Kenny! Hello, how are you? Good to see you. Hello. Sorry if I missed you. <clears throat> I guess, I guess we take this one. Aww, I want to squish her cheeks. We'll never see your character's face again, but we'll know this. We'll know. You'll know. Okay, so now with this in mind, Maybe we do a poll. Maybe a mod can help. Do we have a mod around? Maybe Pega, Consti, a mod to make a poll between this one, which is 38 or 35. Yep, Drex, could you make a poll? 35 or 38? 35 or 38? 32. No, this is no, this is Sunday school and church. Nah. <laughs> no. Oh, phone shut. Shut it. No, this is nah. I mean, it's okay. I had a haircut like this and this little thing would just go me on my go on my nerves all the time. Hairstyle. Yeah, chat. We have a poll running. Let's go. And in the meantime, guys, we have a giveaway running. There's an open giveaway for Black Skylands. There's currently 43 viewers participating. Type I exclamation mark I am chonky if you want to participate. I'm going to pick a, a winner soonish. Let's go. Let's go. Let's let's go. Or 
or you could go for all baldy and make a plot twist on Twitch chat. <laughs> Just the last second, like, whoops, my finger slipped. We, we bald now. Or... Or we go for this fine specimen here. Thank you very much for the reset for 11 months. <laughs> 40 has seen some things. <laughs> Trevor and, and uh, GTA 5, right? Shit, where was I? Here. This one? Oh, this shit. I don't know why why I like this so much. It's just... It reminds me of someone in a, ga in a movie that I've seen and I like it. Hi, Toothless. Oh yes, the math teacher haircut. <laughs> 35 is one, 35 it is. I'm all with your chat. Okay, um... Are we done now here? Dirt. Okay, the last thing was dirt. We good. She cute. I like it. Okay, background. Why you... Why you... Is this no... Is this, is this supposed to ha... Oh, there you go. <laughs> Beast hunter? Oh boy. Oh my god, there's so many! Oh, shit. Oh, hell no. What? Oh, crap. It's gonna take forever. I thought we just, like, we done now. I thought we done now. Oh, my God. Oh, boy. File not found. Ooh. Okay. It's reading time. Beast Hunter. From the Ashta to Aquila to the Terramorphs that plague the whole of the settled systems, hostile alien life abounds. You've learned the skills to track them, find them, and take them down. Fitness. In space, the greatest commodity is oxygen, and the increased lung capacity gained by regular physical fitness regimen is essential to survival. Ballistic. Centuries of conflict have proven that when it comes to threat elimination, Few things stack up to the reliable power of high-speed projectiles. Gastronomy. Access to brand new worlds means access to brand new ingredients, and there's almost no limit to the delicious foods and drinks a talented chef can prepare. Oh wait, you crafting your own food? Oh, oh boy. Nixu and uh, Knights, thank you very much for the resubs. Thank you so much. Your character's Ripley vibes, exactly. That's why I like her haircut so much. She's like 80s alien, right? <laughs> Um, Bouncer, you've worked the line at the toughest clubs in the settled systems. Back then, you learned that most non-lethal confrontations can be solved one of two ways. A strong right hook or a more strongly secured door. Bounty hunter. Uh, chef, combat medic, cyber runner. Should we read all of these or should I just, like, go by the names? I like Explorer from the sound of it. <clears throat> They said exploration is a lost art. You didn't listen. <laughs> As the major factions argued over the space they desperately tried to control, you were busy uncovering the wonders of the settled systems. Lasers. Personal laser weapons are in widespread use across the settled systems, and specialized training can greatly increase their effectiveness. Astrodynamics. Advanced technology is one thing, but it takes skill, patience, and a little bit of love to coax even more cap capability out of a ship's grav... grav di drive? Gravity drive? Hmm. Surveying. Humanity now has access to untold alien worlds and the ability to decipher all that data while on the ground has become an essential skill set. Gangster. Homesteader, industrialist, long hauler. Let those other hot-headed pilots obsess over laser weapons and maneuverability. You're a space trucker. Pure and simple. Hmm. Doesn't sound like me. Pilgrim, wayfarer, wanderer, seeker, transient. You've been called many things during your travels and learned something those others could never understand. The journey is the destination. Professor Ronan. Masterless and unbound, you wandered the settled systems as a blade for hire. Aha, uh -huh, okay. So like a merc. Sculptor. With your knowledge of anatomy and skilled, steady hands, you could have had a lucrative career as a surgeon. Instead, you followed your heart and created works... Of art to amaze and inspire. Soldier. Hmm. <laughs> no Man's Skyrim. High Lone Wolf. 
Uh, the settled systems is no stranger to warfare, and if there's one thing armed conflict relies on, it's trained warriors with guns and guts. You had both. Simple, bloody work, and you were great at it. Space scoundrel. <laughs> Good, bad, who's right is it to say? If there's anything you've learned while traipsing through the galaxy, it's this. Space may look black, but it's really one big shade of gray. <laughs> Xenobiologist. Ooh. I mean, this would kind of like with xenobiologists and then you look like Ellen Ripley. Come on. Um, the settled systems is home to untold alien species. And while none of them have yet proven sentient, that never deterred you. So you sought out and studied them for whatever gifts they offered. File not found. Oddly, there is no information on file about your past life. Clerical oversight? Deletion by some powerful unknown faction? Or was there just nothing to know to mention? Aww, I was boring. <laughs> Whatever the reason, your past is known only to you. What's important is the here and now and the path you are about to forge. I think this is like, if you don't really commit to anything, really, this might be a good, a good base. Only been doing character creation for under an hour, you exaggerators. True, it's been under an hour so far. Or like roughly an hour. We had 40 minutes of just like talking before. Um, wellness. By embracing an active lifestyle and good nutrition habits, one may improve their overall sense of health and even gain prolonged life expectancy. Ballistic. Centuries of conflict have proven that when it comes to threat elimination, few things stack up to the reliable power of high-speed projectiles. Piloting. As more people journey into space, the number of those set certified to effectively pilot various types of spacecraft has increased dramatically. I don't really know how big the impact is of this. Usually in Bethesda games, it's like you just get like a general direction, but you can decide you want to do something completely different with your character, right? So, I don't know. Gangster Liz has a good ring to it. I'm not a gangster, though. Gangster sounds like something negative, and... I don't, in I don't intend to box, for example. I like the shotgun stuff. And theft. I mean, I like looting, but if I see it's stealing, I'm usually not touching it, so... Juso, thank you for the nine months tier two resub. Enjoy the emotes, my friend. How you doing? Hey, Liz and mods and chat. It's half a year already. No, it's over half a year already. It's, it's a Twitch baby already, Juso. Thank you so much for such a long time of support. Hope you're doing good. I think you got the basic abilities beforehand. It shouldn't matter that much traits are the big changers. Oh, okay. So, f just from the ring of it, not knowing what else is going to happen a lot, I think my... I'm leaning most to Explorer. Maybe Pilgrim, but more Explorer, actually. Um, and Final Not Found? I think. I mean, I didn't read all of them, but some of them just didn't sound very interesting to me, like Professor. been playing for 69 hours. How's the game so far? <laughs> I haven't been. <laughs> I haven't been playing so long. Loot, shotgun, and treasures with more loot. <laughs> they won't bet. Casino sounds good. Laser serving and fitness. Oh, I don't know how really, how much they impact the, the game in the end. List the explorer, right? I mean, hmm. Does have a nice ring to it. Lasers, astrodynamics, and serving. But wellness, ballistics, or shooting, and piloting sounds like this is li literally just the base of things that you need. You look like a gangster to me. Bruh. <laughs> List the redacted. Um, I like the file not found. I think these things are just like super basic and they all of this seems like it's something that I could use. Wellness, ballistic and piloting sounds like this is literally all the things that you need in the game or so. Let's go with that. Traits. Oof. 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 Introvert, that's so me. 
You really need your alone time. Exerting yourself uses less oxygen when adventuring alone, but more when adventuring with other human companions can be combined with extrovert. Well, obviously, duh. I'm an introvert. Yup. You gotta pick the hero worship, please, 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 what? I'm, <laughs> Boomly, I'm picking my own playthrough, okay? <laughs> if I like it, then I may pick it. Alien DNA. You volunteered for a controversial experiment that combines alien and human DNA. As a result, you start with increased health and oxygen, but healing and food items aren't as effective. Huh. Dream home. You own a luxurious, customizable house on a peaceful planet. Unfortunately, it comes with a 125 credit mortgage with gel bank that has to be paid weekly. No. <laughs> Empath. Oh man. That... That sounds like me. You are deeply connected to the feelings of others, performing actions your companion likes. I don't have a companion, so skip that. Free Star Collective Settler. You gain access to special Free Star Collective dialogue options and better rewards from some missions given by the faction. But crime bounty towards other factions is greatly increased. Can be combined with any other faction legion's trait. Hero worship. You've earned the attention of an annoying, adoring fan. Who will show up randomly and jabber at you incessantly. On the plus side, he'll join your ship's crew and give you... Cr no! N introvert! Introvert! No! <laughs> Hell no! Kid stuff. Your parents are alive and well and you can visit them at their home? No. Neon Street Red. You grew up on the mean streets of Neon. You gain access to special dialogue options and better rewards for some missions on Neon. Crime bounty by other factions is greatly increased. Can't be combined with any other faction legion trait. Raised Enlightened. You grew up as a member of the Enlightened. Uh oh, this sounds like a cult. You gain access to the special chests full of items. That sounds good. In the House of the Enlightened and the New Atlantis, but also access to the Sanctum Universum chest. Can't be combined, okay? Raised Universal. You grew up as a member of the Sanctum Univer- Sanctum Universum. You gain access to a special chest full of items in the Sanctum Universum in New Atlantis, but lose access to the House of the Enlightened chest. Serpent's Embrace. Ooh, you grew up worshipping the Great Serpent. Graph Jumping provides a temporary boost to health and oxygen, but health and oxygen are lowered if you don't continue jumping regularly. Like an addiction. You know what I always do? I was growing up playing Morrowind. I said that earlier, right? And what I did was I was to raise my athleticism and acrobatics. I always jumped through Morrowind. I was just like bow, 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 and then every now and again it was like, ah, oh, level up, ah, oh, level up. You increased your athleticism. <laughs> every now and again, this bong, 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 bong. Everybody else was just like, <laughs> and me, boink, boink. So that I. I don't understand why it's serpent and then jumping, because a serpent cannot really jump, can they? But that's not too bad. We're gonna mark that for now. Spaced. Your body has become acclim acclimated to space. Health and oxygen are increased when in space, but decreased when on the surface. Can be combined with terra firma. Hmm. Taskmaster. Occasionally, if you have new crew trained in a certain ship system, that system will automatically repair itself to full health whenever it is damaged below 50%. However, all crew cost, all crew cost twice as much to hire. Oh, crap. Terra firma. You've never acclimated to space. Health and oxygen are increased when on the surface, but decreased when you're in space. Am I just going to be floating in space? United Colonies Native. You gain access to special United Colonies dialogue options and better rewards from some missions given by the faction. However, crime bounty by other factions is greatly increased. Morrowind, my daughter stole all the pillows across the land and kept them in one house. <laughs> awesome. Wanted. Someone put a prize on your head? No, 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 no. No. Was looping in her head before she <laughs> it was cool. Bow, bow, bow. Space warping on planets. You volunteered for a controversial experiment that combines alien and human DNA. As a result, you start with increased health and oxygen, but healing and food items aren't as effective. <laughs> I like...
Graph jumping provides a temporary boost to health and oxygen, but health and oxygen are lowered if you don't continue jumping regularly. So if I just, like, keep on jumping around, we good? Can be combined? Hmm. We all know you'd snoo snoo an alien list. Just Garrus. <laughs> Garrus is different. Hi, Salty. Hello. Uh, one is really cool. You can use it to lure a mercenary ship to you in space and then kill them and take their ship. Huh. Sounds like making your life harder. Coming to space, health and oxygen are increased when on the surface, but decreased when you're in space. Maybe this? Occasionally, if you have a crew trained in a certain ship system, that system will automatically repair itself to full health whenever it is damaged below 50%. However, all crew costs twice as much to hire. No. No, 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 no. Hi, Mira, by the way. Welcome in. Serpent means jumping between planets, not jumping on the ground. What? If you have crew trained in a certain ship system that... No, wait. Serpent. You grew up worshipping the Great Serpent. Graph jumping. Oh, graph jumping! I was just reading jumping. Provides a temporary boost to health and oxygen. Crap. Crap. You might like kid stuff? No, I read it. I didn't like it. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. I was I was thinking about the alien DNA, but I don't like that that healing and food items aren't as effective. That seems like a big, big downside. I don't like empath either because I'm not going to be uh, using a companion. I like to be alone. How does it sound handy? Performing actions your companion likes will result in a temporary increase. Guys, empath combined with introvert sounds like a horrible idea. I'm gonna read you the introvert thing again. You really need your time alone. Exerting yourself uses less oxygen when adventuring alone, but more when adventuring with other human companions can be combined with extrovert. So if you if you want if you benefit from being alone, it doesn't make sense to combine that with something like empath, where it focuses on having a companion. Dream home sounds like crap too because you have to you mortgage you have to weekly you have to send money somewhere no sounds like making your life harder as well this might be the best thing you just like have a buff to health and oxygen you just it's like the items are just less useful why is all of this mostly negative good question hero worship is the best sounds like a very annoying thing it sounds like something like those... Oh god, what was her name again? Oh, curveball? No. What was her name in Spider-Man? Oh god, this woman was so annoying. I hated her. I just wanted to... You know? No thanks. Let's take this. Introvert terra firma. So... Health and oxygen are increased on the surface. And as a result, you start with increased health and oxygen. But healing and food items aren't as effective. And then introvert, you benefit from being alone. I think there will be a lot of potential companions. Do you think there's going to be a dog that doesn't talk? That'd be nice. Maybe this. Alien DNA, introvert, and terra firma sounds good to me. Employee number, that is a long number. Hopefully a pet alien or a pet space doggy. Yeah, that'd be cool. All right, are we done? I think we're done. Do I need to pick a name? Well, it says human companion. What says human companion? I'm sorry. I'm I'm good too, uh, Juso. I'm just tired. Time to pack up and move to work later, Liz. Bye, Kenny. Bye. Have a good time at work. 
<laughs> boldly go away. No lizard has gone before you. Bye. <laughs> bye bye. All right. Um. 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 Finish. R. I guess we're good. Okay. How do we call her? Do we call her spaceless? <laughs> how do we call her, Chad? Are we just gonna go with Liz? Introvert specifies human companion. That's good. That means I can have like a. Uh, Ripley. Hmm. Hmm. Ellen Ripley's? <gasps> Commander Shapless! Laserless. <laughs> pew, 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 pew! Um... Hans, thank you so much, Hans! For the five gifted subs! Guys, enjoy the emotes, everybody who got a sub. Also, guys, I think it's time that we pick a winner for the giveaway. So, last chance. You have a few more seconds to join the giveaway for Black Skylands. <laughs> nice list but you but <laughs> oh nice yeah good idea strongly's looterless hmm. was it five to you three oh why does it do, twitch this is important info why are you not showing this hans thank you for the five tier three subs holy shizzle Thank you so much, Hans. Guys, can we get some chonky chonks in chat? Everybody who got a sub, enjoy the 68 emotes that tier 3 subscribers can use. Welcome to the chonky chonks. Uh, Are we go with Ripley's? As in Ripley, but Rip, like, from Alien? Okay, guys, I'm gonna pick the winner now. And... Close. And now I'm gonna pick a winner, okay? Jen, are you here? Jen Maggot. If you're here, please come forward and say hello. Uh, hi, Jimmy. Half a year. It's Thank me. Hi. I'm the problem. It's me. <gasps> Whee! Um. Thank you so much for the six-month reset with Prime, Jimmy. And hi, Clarice. You're welcome in. Combine space and list to make something terrible spliz nah please no ripless looks like rest and, and peaceless oh oh man l l liz ripley instead of ellen ripley ellis ripley or liz ripley <laughs> Oh fuck. Jen, are you Jen? Jen, you won. Okay, Jen. Um Oh god, I hope the game is, is okay with tabbing out. Anybody any ideas? Liz Ripper, no no. I think I think we're gonna go with Liz Ripley, no. Uh the final founder okay, good. Enter. Name character? E pronoun being confirmed. Confirm? Are we good? Well, you got the sample. Client's on his way. Then we all get paid. You remember anything that happened? There was this light and music. It was incredible, like a dream or a vision. Everything's a blank. Everything's a blank? After I went into the tunnel. What? What is that thing? It was incredible, like a dream and a vision. Easy there, high flyer. Probably just the endorphins kicking in when you passed out. Don't go having an experience on me. You'll walk it off. More importantly, 
We got what we were looking for. All this trouble for that stupid thing? Huh. Sure don't look like much. Never mind what it looks like. It's <laughs> worth more than this mine has pulled in all month. We'll be... Speak of the devil. Press mouse 3 to switch between first and third person. Ooh. Nice. Constellation contact is on approach. Wait, the explorers group? <laughs> I thought they were kind of a joke. Not a joke. You're just too young to know better. Hey, I'm just saying they got a reputation. Hell, I bet half the crew here doesn't even believe Circuit they really board. exist. Can I pick all the loot? Whoa. You don't look good. Well, thanks. That's what every girl wants to hear. Thank you so much. Dan, can you make sure to, to write me a message? Uh, a whisper? So I can send you the key for the game you won? Is it is it just me or is this the, 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 uh, everything a bit sensitive here? Where do I do that? I'm sorry, guys, for doing lots of setting up stuff stuff today controls maybe aim sensitivity controller look uh is there something like walk sensitivity do you know inward menu flight stick swap roll dominant look sensitivity aim sensitivity i don't see walk sensitivity or something I think you can walk slowly by pressing caps lock. Mm hmm. That's like super slow. That's like grandma on a Sunday walk slow. Can I take Lynch this? Sure seems to like you. Cut. Guess she would know. Being the boss and all. Hang on. Hello, miner. You're cute. I like ya. <laughs> Making friends already. Sorry. All right, Dusty. Airlock. Put your helmet on. Press tap to open the data menu. Select the area in the lower right to access your inventory. Oh. Star map. Skills. This is just empty inventory. Okay. Select the helmets category. He, he, um. Cutter, deep mining, space shoot, uh, tunnel mining. I don't see helmet. Am I blind? I'm not seeing helmet. Am I blind? <laughs> I see all resources. Aid. Mining utility probably here? Something, I guess? Oh, help! None equipped. Oh, man, I was reading here. And then it says helmets. My, my brain is, like, filtering the first few letters. And if it's not matching, if it's not matching, like, if somebody would say, look for space helmet, I read deep. Okay, this is not, this is not helmet. Okay, there you go. Anybody else like this? I'm just filtering. And if it's not in there, I'm moving on. Hans, thanks for gifting another sub. Thank you. My god, how are we like this? I was born this way. All right. That music was very Bethesda. Hello? Hello? I don't know, if, am I supposed to pick all of these things up or... <laughs> Probably not. 
I'm gonna just look around a little bit. Tex, thank you so much for the 10 gifted subs. Thank you so much. All the buttons at once. Thank you so much. I don't know if I'm allowed to run around right now. <laughs> A joke from Strictly. What is the longest word in the English language? Smiles, because there is a mile between the S's. <laughs> da -da -da -da. Thank you so much, Tex, for the 10 gifted subs. Everybody, make sure to thank you, Gifter. And enjoy the emotes in the after watching, of course. I'm just looking around if I can find more met stuff. It doesn't say stealing, so why not take it? You're right. I feel like I should m maybe save. <laughs> Juso! Thank you so much for the 1969! Holy moly! Thank you so much. <laughs> Very nice. Thank you so much for that, Juso. Um, guys, again, it's it's as it's September. I already explained that in the beginning of the stream, but uh, we don't have a bit goal. We don't have a tips goal. We just have a sub goal, sub points goal. Remember, F5 to quick save. I know, I know. I just like. It's my first save today, so I would like to normally save. Your tastes are a bit more sophisticated now, huh? So, you found something? Right here. The new girl found it. Hi. That's right. And everything went cool? Just like grabbing those minerals on Bendy? Kazan. And no, Barrett. Not cool. She passed out after the extraction. Woke up saying all kinds of nonsense. Hey! Is that I can right? hear you. Went on a trip, huh? Well, a bit. You could call it that. I'm fine. Nothing to talk about. How would you know about that? Because Lynn was talking on me. I... Uh, all right. What? A little disappointing, not gonna lie, but reveling in the weird of space isn't everyone's idea of a good time. I... I get it. Didn't want to select that. Oops. Okay, just hand over the credits, and I'll be happy to never Oops. see this thing. Or you ever again. That's why I like you, Lynn. All business. <laughs> Barrett, the scanners on the frontier are reporting a ship coming in hot from orbit. I really thought I lost them. Barrett? Are you the not new Cotsworth? Meet with the client. What? What is going on? What's going on? Yo, bro, this is my this is where I wanted to hide. Oh here we go. I don't want to accidentally shoot my people because everyone looks so far looks the same, right? Okay, you are you are nasty. Can I can I hurt you with that thing? Wait, I had a I had a weapon, right? Hang on. Inventory? Cutters. I don't want a cutter, I want a pistol. Didn't I get a pistol? Ammo eight mm, deep mm, new items? Ha! This baby? Aha! Pirate. Oh god, I have to get used to that. <laughs> the little hops. Smooth, thank you for the three months. Where? Unlocker, how do I hit? 
Can I destroy your bloody helmet? Oh shit. Oh, 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 oh. Pirate. Oh shit, nerds. Somebody cover me! Can we? <laughs> Go to Bethesda, right? God, I've been playing turn-based games for a month now. I don't even know how to play stuff like this anymore. He is ringing. Stop wiggling around so much, pirate chick. Can I? Oh, God. I missed this. Maelstrom. I don't know what that is. Can I loot y'all? Credits. Pirate assault space helmet. Cutter. Wee! Five XP this year overpowered. I'm just I'ma just take it all. The winner takes it all. Right. Hey Mar, hello. Smooth, thank you for the three month resub. Hope you're doing good. Can't believe the Crimson Fleet hit us. The Crimson Fleet, okay, that explains the color of the suits. This attack better not be coming out of our pay. Hmm. Space V bag and hell yeah. to have suffered fewer casualties than would be expected. Nice. Jusul, thanks for the gifted sub. We're still in one piece. Of course Barrett was being followed. Oh, okay, Barrett. Barrett. Hello. Well, that was some fine work on the pressure. <laughs> thanks. You dug up the artifact, right? That means you saw it. The visions? You're coming with me to Constellation. You're part of this now. What? If they can call me, what does art- Wait, wait. If they can tell me- Oh, sorry. Oh, man. What, where did I get the call from? I don't know. If they can tell me what this artifact of yours is, I'm in. If you'll take me off this damn moon, sign me up. Whoa, wait, I didn't ask for any of this. What is Constellation anyway? I like asking questions first and foremost before deciding for anything, so maybe that? You ever stare up at the stars at night wondering what's out there? Well, that's us. Stars? That's where we go. Okay. If they can tell me what the artifact is of yours, I'm in. If you'll take me off this damn moon, sign me up. Well, I'm curious about this artifact, so let's go. Marvelous. Oh no, Barrett. No. You think you're just going to take off after the mess you caused? All right. I guess I did just put you all on the Crimson Fleet hit list. <laughs> How about I stay and I send your Dusty here in my place? I, I, I know, I know, but she's not some miner anymore, Lynn. Soon as she touched that rock, something changed. Don't tell me you can't feel it. Fine. It's a deal. Get out of here, Dusty. You're on to bigger things. Thanks for everything, Lynn. No way. Not my job. What about the mine? Don't you need me? Well, I like shooting things better than mining things, so uh, bye, Lynn. Thanks for everything. Just go. Before I say something, I regret. Yeah. Well, now that that's settled. Vasco, get her to the lodge. No deviations unless absolutely necessary, okay? Protocol Indigo. Indigo. Again. Very well. Oh, and hey, take this. You'll find it very useful out there. And it even tells the time. It even tells the time? A watch? I can't believe it! I got a watch that can tell the time! Hey, look at that. The watch fits you perfectly. Now, <laughs> questions? Yeah, could you hold the pose just for a second? Pharrell, thank you so much for 50 gifted subs. Holy frick, what? That is madness, my man. Madness. Thank you so, so, so much. Pharrell, for the 50, I hope everybody who got a sub enjoys the emotes. I make them myself. And the ad free watching, of course. Thank you so, so much. Hans, thanks for the three month gifted 
No, wait, the one month tier three sub to Pharrell. Pharrell enjoy the emotes as well, 68 of them. And Pian, thank you for the tier two resub. Guys, you're absolute crazy. Guys, can everybody, can we get some, some hyper in chunks or, or this one here? Everybody can use this one if they're a follower. Thinking it over? To celebrate yes, Pharrell. Thank you. Wild. Jen, I haven't forgotten you. I will send you the key uh, maybe in a break or... Uh, another 50? What? <laughs> what? Pharrell, thank you so much for 100 gifted subs in total now. Holy moly. Guys, we are three subs away from the next giveaway already. <laughs> how? How, guys? How are we doing this? Barbos, thanks for the biddies. Pharrell, please make sure to take care of yourself first, okay? I appreciate you, but please. Okay? You, you first. Thank you so much. Thank you. Oh, thank you so much. And tax another five... Bloody hell, you guys hey, are killing me. Uh, I'm sorry, Barrett. I'm so sorry, but chat is going wild. What am I supposed to do? Holy moly. Holy moly. Okay, we're gonna we gotta start the next giveaway in a bit, but let me let me just like talk to Barrett for Oh my god. Guys, thank you so much for your support. Yo, you're, you're wild. Don't worry, my money is well spent. Thank you, Pharrell. Thank you so much. Um um why send me? Shouldn't you go? You're giving me your ship? Who are you? What's Constellation? What exactly did we dig up? Why was the Crimson Fleet after you? Yeah, so f questions first. Oh, all of them are questions. Okay, what exactly did we d dig up? That, my friend, is the million credit question. And Constellation can find the answer. With your help. Um... Why was the Crimson Fleet after you? They're just following the loop, like pirates do. And I have something of a reputation as a loot collector. <gasps> Me too! We have so much in common! Okay, um, who are Stumped. you? Happens to the best of us. <laughs> um... You're giving me your ship. Technically, it's not even mine. Consider it alone. Whose is it? Bosco will keep you on course. Besides, I'm making an exception, since you can tell Constellation about that vision you had. Whose is it though? Like I don't wanna I don't wanna be running from people trying to get their shit back <laughs> and they kicking me out to the space then afterwards. Um 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 why is, maybe I should just ask all the questions. Guys, you're you're showering me so much in support and I appreciate you so much. Thank you. Shawnee, thanks for the six month resub. Love you listen, you chat. Thank you so much, Shawnee. Thank you so much, guys. Hi, TW. Thanks for the first time sub of Prime, guys. You're the best. Okay, the what's consolation? See, that's the problem with the settled systems. Too easy to take everything for granted. While everyone else is busy playing politics, we're the ones braving the unknown, charting the vastness of space. <laughs> Without us, the galaxy is just a big room with the lights turned out. <laughs> What's happening? <laughs> Hans, another five tier threes. Oh. <laughs> Thank you so much, Hans. And Zandi, 20. Oh my god. Guys! Hype train! <laughs> what level have we reached already? Holy moly, we should be level, I don't know, 69 already. Um, 
Zandy, thanks for the 20 gifted subs. Megalog, thanks for the biddies. Guys, you're awesome. Thank you so much. Come on. You're really not at all curious about that light music show you experienced? Well, Why it yeah. only affected you? Because if you didn't notice, we've all been handling it since with no problem. The way I see it, Constellation needs that artifact, but they also need you. This mystery is only getting bigger each step we take. And you're part of it now. Every step I over? take. Good instinct. Every move I make. Oh my bloody. Lambrino, thanks for the five gifted subs. And Victor, thanks for the 27 month resub. Juso, thanks for the two guys. You, this is wild. Holy mo I didn't ex- I didn't expect we would have- we would reach anything today, so we already have- I could already start the next giveaway, I just want to finish the talk with Barrett. Twelve thousand bits. <laughs> what?! Holy. What? So, yeah, oh, sorry. exactly, Barrett. I'm but sorry. You said something. <sighs> Jesus. Pharrell, thank you for the twelve thousand bits. Holy moly! Thank you so much. You're. I think you're on the way to unlocking all of my face emotes. <laughs> thank you so much, guys. We need some. We need some. Some emote spam here in chat. Holy moly. Lila, thanks for the five gifted. Thank you. Juso, thanks for the two. Mini, thanks for the resub. You guys are awesome. Professor Wolin, thanks for the gifted sub as well. Starfield Day! Yes, finally! Um. Oh, I can just exit without. And Vasco, oh. Don't let her break my ship. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. So, let me make a save real quick. And I hope the game is not a game that- Oh, I like the HUD. Oh. That is cool. I like that. What is- what is this icon there? Do we have a map? Oh. Vectera, Moon of Ancelon. Survey, 80%. What is this? Board the sh oh, it's just my- what- No, this is board the ship. Argos Extractors Mining Outpost. Aha, uh -huh, okay. I wonder if it's gonna be a lot like um, Mass Effect exploring in space. Okay. Swan, thanks for the five gifted. All right, guys. I'm just gonna. Please don't crash. Okay. Um. I'm so sorry. I'm just gonna quickly send Jen the key that Jen won. Alright, and then we start the next giveaway already, because you already unlocked that. Um, I, sorry, I'm so unprepared because I didn't expect anything to happen today. <laughs> uh, so... Reset successful. Okay, set giveaway. The next giveaway that we have is um, from GOG, and the game is called Guilt, with a Y. And now we open that one up. And you guys can join if you want. Wow, we wa. And now we can go back to Starfield. Nice. Thank you guys so much. Absolutely madness. Thank you, thank you. Swan, thanks for the five gifted. Are you my friend now, Vasco? Are you my new Cotsworth? Just up the ramp, Captain. I'll be in the external robotics bay. I'm a that sound, man. These sounds are so fallout, aren't they? Guys, thank you so much for everything. You're awesome. Frontier? I want to look around. I want to see if I can loot anything. I might have to lower the, the look sensitivity, I feel. By extinguisher. I don't think I'm gonna need that. Ooh! We going, chat! We going! Captain, 
Ripley. I assume you know how to fly a Class A starship. As Barrett likes to say, it's as easy as learning to ride a bike. Yo. I will attempt to boost the shields, just in case there are any difficulties. Wait. Wait, what? Did the... Did, did the... Did, did the... Did the game just call me by my name? By the name that I gave my character? I called my character Liz Ripley and he just said Captain Ripley. What? That is so cool. That is so, I love that. I wanna eat that sandwich, a bitten sandwich. That's okay, can I eat that? <laughs> Chunks apple. Snack pack, choco bites, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. container of cereal. Impact driver, I don't know what that does. Oh man, I love it so far. What's this? Barrett, personal slate. You know the drill, Vasco. Protocol indigo means no deviations, no distractions, no dalliances, in short, no fun. Oof, no fun? Unless, as strictly defined by Sarah, said deviations, distractions, and dalliances are completely necessary in getting this fine vessel, the Discovery Class Starship Frontier, back home in one piece. I guess I'm still technically borrowing it from Constellation, even if I have no intention of actually giving it back. Oh, savage. Barrett? How dare you? So something like a zoom? Oh, oh, this is not a zoom button. No, put that put that thing away. Bed, sleep. Ooh, Chad, I'm liking this a lot. I'm liking this a lot. Research station. Oh, the research lab lets you discover new crafting recipes by completing research projects. Each research project requires materials in order to make progress. The materials needed can range from raw minerals extracted from planets to organic substances extracted from alien creatures and plant life to manufactured components that can be made at an industrial workbench. Okay. Pharmacology, food and drink, outpost development, equipment and weaponry. Stupid goose! Bloody mother. 20 gifted subs. You guys are absolutely killing me today. I did not- I w I'm not prepared! <laughs> Stupid goose, thanks for the 20 gifted subs. Spudman, thanks for the two month resub. And Bo, five, thank you for the five gifted subs. Guys, can we get some hype in chat for all those lovely supporters here? You- the hell? <laughs> I have early access on my Xbox series. Nice! Very, very impressed with it. It's very pretty. Uh, medical treatment. Ooh. I think I will take some time to get used to all the hot stuff. Old Earth Cuisine. Beverage development. Uh, this doesn't look too tasty. Sorry, green. Mixology. <laughs> Mixology? What? Is that even a word? Decoration. Oh, you can even you can even craft interior stuff. What is this? A 3D printer? Grip and stock mods. Oh my god. It's, I'm gonna take forever to learn all of the stuff. Oh cool. Oh, oh, oh. I'm sorry, I'm just so excited. I love the looks of it as well. I think it looks... I think it looks very nice. I think it looks like a very well-polished Bethesda game. You know, it like, still has the Bethesda feel. But it, it, just, it just looks way better than, like, the previous games that they made. Of course, I mean, there's so many years between that, but... Like, the, the Heller guy had way better facial expressions, too, you know? Usually Bethesda games are like... <laughs> and and Heller had proper facial expressions. Lynn was a bit like, mm, but Heller had really pr proper facial expressions. Looked like a human. Pilot seat. Am I actually gonna fly that thing? Oh god. Oh god. Don't make me fly that thing. I'm gonna. <laughs> I'm gonna. Shields ready. The rest is up to you. Oh god. This is going down. 
let's save. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill this thing. Oh boy. Okay, take off. Oh crap. Oh, I don't have to. Okay, it's a cutscene. <laughs> I'm sorry. <clears throat> Fangirl moment. For all into the star field. <gasps> wow. Well, this is cool. I like that. Now that we are in orbit, it might be wise to test all controls and systems to ensure they are not on the verge of catastrophic failure. Yeah. I can step you through the entire process. That's good. Or if you're already an experienced pilot, just power up all the systems and we'll be on our way. No, walk me through it, please. Hold left alt and use WASD to switch between systems and allocate power. You can skip the ship tutorial by powering up all systems, including the grav drive. Left alt and then WASD, okay. Hold left alt and use WASD to allocate power. Each system on a ship requires power. Allocating power is under your direct control. <gasps> you have to balance it? One small step. Mission status. I might need Xbox controller for the ship. I have my Thrustmaster. An adequate pilot. Are you familiar with ship combat <laughs> tactics? Um, I'm not really yeti ready yet. What the heck? I wasn't. I wasn't ready yet. <laughs> I wasn't ready yet. Laser-based weaponry is particularly effective. This is nasty. Don't no bully. If you can keep the enemy ship centered on the HUD, we can lock in to fire a homing missile. I cannot. The enemy shields are down, Captain. Ballistic weaponry excels at damaging the hull once shields are offline. What? Sorry, I couldn't. What? M miss missile? And now what? I couldn't pay attention because I thought this was not supposed to happen. Can I just shoot like this? Why can't I shoot anymore? Haha! <laughs> Ooh, I like the explosion. Congratulations on surviving your first Starship Assault, Captain. Hmm. We should search the wreckage for spare parts and other salvage. We should? We need to fly close to it before we can access the remains. Okay. Oh god! <laughs> How do I... Oh god, this is odd! Oh my god! Oh, stop it! How do you fly this thing? I feel like they could have taken me- given me a bit more time to actually understand what he wanted me to do because he was like, you have to allocate certain things. And then, oh by the way, you're in battle right now! And now you have- you have wreckage parts flying at you and you're just trying- still- I'm- I'm still at the allocating parts. I'm still at the hold alt and allocate parts thing. Like, I haven't understood that part yet. Press E to cycle between space targets. Are you freaking kidding me? Could we? Oh, what? Why are you getting up? No, 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 no. Could you, love, could you please sit down again? Sit down. <laughs> I'm... Game, come on. Look, it's a bit fast right now. This is still gonna break. Great, now the ship is the the, the shield is down, but Is it is this is how is this how it's supposed to be? You're like trying to figure out how this works, and then game is like, yeah, you you gonna. Oh, 
I love how I hear the the voices of the other of the other ships. Like, oh, ah, oh. <laughs> enemy missile is locked. Something. Oh god, I can't read that fast. Captain, we are walking you through how this works. And then suddenly, oh yeah, you're, you're being constantly assaulted. <laughs> Had the same issue yesterday. I couldn't figure out how to loot the ship after I took it down. I felt like instructions were all over the place. Yeah, I don't know how the missile works, guys. The game was like, hey, so you have to, you have certain amount of points and you have to put them in something with Alt and WASD, right? And that's where I was stuck. And then suddenly attack. And then suddenly another attack. And now I'm I'm still at step one. And he's already at step four. So how do I do stuff? <laughs> of continual assault from their ships are high enough to jeopardize. Oh god, this sounds like there's gonna be another attack now. They are after the frontier and will not stop. It's on the screen. There's so much on the screen. How do I how do I loot this without crushing into it now? One small step. Travel to Crete. Yeah. First, first I would like to loot stuff. Press tab to open the data menu. I I still need to loot things. Game, I think. So you just fly up there and then you click E? And, but I need to fly up there, right? And I'm not just like... Reduce power to thrust. Uh, so this is what I mean. I think I'm supposed to... to relocate certain points, but this is where I was attacked and then I couldn't... Did I loot this now? Crimson Fleet Ghost something something. Uh, there. This is weird. Aha! Okay, so you just click Eve. Okay. Okay, so looting, looting. Oh god, this is weird. <laughs> this is this. Is, this the controls are are weird. So I have. LAS, which I guess is laser, bell, probably balance, MSL, missiles, ENG, energy, SHD, I don't know, and GRV is probably gravity. So, I don't really know what the... Do I have to, like, change that on the... Oh, bonk, bonk, bonk. Do I have to change that on the fly? Engine. Ah, an SHD shield. Okay. Thank you. Keys for every function on the screen. Yeah, but um, he probably explained to me when I do what and I didn't, I didn't pick it up because I, suddenly I was under fire. Change this however you feel the need. But while you were attacked, isn't that a bit difficult to manage while you're being under attack? You, you, you cannot pause it, right? Am I moving at all? Multitasking. I, I'm, uh, call me old school, call me a boomer, whatever. I, but I prefer learning something and then using it and not like having overlay that is completely new having somebody talking explaining you stuff in the background and then also having to fight in the meantime e three things at once i'm i'm too slow for that i'm sorry i'm stupid but i i cannot listen to somebody talking to me having to deal with a completely new hud and allocating some points and then also fighting um while i'm being you know under attack how the what is <laughs> um open planet map Show resources? Oh. Probing your anus. Really, Shepard? Extreme environment, okay. 
But this is where we came from. This is not where we want to go, right? So we go one out and we want to go to Crete, I think, here. Travel to Crete. Set course to Crete, yes. Travel, X. Hi, Ollie, welcome in. We have arrived in orbit. The abandoned facility with our Crimson Fleet captain is on the surface. Press tab to open the data menu. From there, you can open the star map. Ship, star map, skills. The planet view of the star map gives you information about the environment, lets you scan the planet for resources, and helps you discover key landing sites. So this is a lot like uh, Mass Effect then, right? You're scanning a planet, and then you probably have like maybe one or two landing sites where you go on and then you can do certain quests maybe and you can um, scan and probe it for certain items and minerals and such or so it sounds to me right now so yeah um is it too early to ask your first impression of starfield yes <laughs> Uh, basically, the rule of thumb on my channel is when I have made an opinion of or thoughts of a game, there will be the thoughts command that I have written down my thoughts. Bye, Bobby. Hi, X Dragon. Lasers are better for taking down shields and ballistics once the shields are down. Okay. This you aren't stupid. You're just sleepy. You're playing a new game, and chat's not only going regular prayer, but also prayer support for your lovely streamer. <laughs> yeah, which I'm very grateful for. Uh, rotate the planet until- wait, uh, the planet view of the star map gives you information about the environment, blah, 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 blah. Okay, I read this. Rotate the planet until the Crete Research Lab map, map icon is in view, then select the map icon to land there. Here. Boop. Land, please. Liz Ripley. Level 1. The Crimson Fleet is a loose confederation of independent pirate groups that frequently cause trouble throughout... something. I'll follow you from here on out, Captain. Mm. Exit ship, take off, get up. Exit ship. Crete, it's a moon. 25 degrees temperature. Is that Fahrenheit or is that Celsius? Or a new kind of. Wow! Wow! <laughs> I love that. Sorry, what? Vasco, could you repeat yourself? Captain Ripley. Hi. Protocol Indigo dictates that I am to return to the lodge with no deviations. We are here to stop the Crimson Fleet from pursuit. Nothing more. Okay. Why is this Crimson Fleet captain after Barrett? I have often asked Barrett that same question at various times and about various individuals that wanted to cause us harm. Oh no. The most likely answer is that Barrett personally insulted him, typically by continuing to live usually after escaping from certain death and often with an object multiple people wanted. Typically by continuing to live. <laughs> how how does this Malacca still live? Um, just who are you and Barry? What's Constellation? Constellation is an explorer's society founded over 50 years ago with the mission of seeking out the unknown. Ooh. Members often engage in expeditions in small groups, typically one or two people, or like Barrett and myself, one person and one robot. The membership is intentionally limited and small. Should you join Constellation yourself, you will be the 10th active member. Why is Barrett trusting me with this ship? Barrett would say that billions of years ago, we were all one with the cosmos. So technically, you have known each other forever. 
But the more practical answer is likely that he needs you. The number <laughs> of known people who have been affected by the artifacts is now two. Without your investment in Constellation's mission, he may never know more about the experience you both share. So he is showing you trust in order to gain your support. Okay, so he's using me. <laughs> we. Hi, Apollo. Hi, Hades. Welcome in, everyone. Good to see you. Let's trade gear. Ooh. There is room in my storage hold for further items. I've sworn to carry your burden. Uh, the, the, the laser cartridge? Take. That's it? So he's sworn to carry more burdens, I guess, but th that's it? Q? Hmm. I like Vasco. Oh, oh, this is where we need to go. But how far can I go? How how much can you are you going without me or are you following me now? Vasco. Imperialist, thanks for the eight month resub. Welcome back. Thank you so much. Forward to watching your playthrough, Captain Ripley. What is this? Oh god. Oh, I love that so much in Fallout 4, when you run around and the the gun wobbles like this. I don't- I just like it. What is that? Can I not pick it up? Hmm. Well, I tried. Whee! Oh god, I love this! Bounce. Bounce. Whee! Whee! Oh crap! Extreme heat. Uh oh. Why is there suddenly extreme heat? Protection region. How did that happen all of a sudden? Oh, extreme heat again. Uh oh. No hurt. Okay, I guess we're supposed to go in there. Uh oh. You can scan it? How do I scan? Oh, O2 is just like, you use it up. It's like stamina, basically. F. Scan creatures, minerals, and plants. Each unique item scanned progresses your survey data of the planet. Completely survey data can be sold for credits. Ooh, the scanner mode also unlocks additional features such as building outposts and using... <laughs> Another outpost needs your help. <laughs> and using social skills like diplomacy and intimidation. Ooh. Okay, dust root. How do I actually... Uh, I have just 30% scanned. How do I... Oh. How do I scan more of it? Or do I have to, like... No. Thor, thanks for gifting us up to Field of Stars. I like that. Photo mode. Back. You need to scan others. Oh! Ah, okay, so you, you don't have to... Okay, you just need to go to other ones. Ah, yeah. Asti. Thank you very much, guys, for the help. In my defense, I'm running on very little sleep for a week now. Do I need to be very cl I need to be close, okay. We're over halfway through already with the scans. Or not. Deal with the Crimson Fleet, okay. Thor, thank you very much for the gifted sub. And Saudi, thank you so much for the five. Thank you, guys. Everybody enjoy the emotes. I make them myself. Wow! <laughs> I forgot about how far I can jump with this now. What's there? Whoa.
50% scan of the dust root. Can you rescue Matt Damon? Matt Damon. Yeah, I bet you can. So there's something over there and there's our main agenda over there. So maybe we go over there first. Or maybe we should maybe we should focus on the plot, the main plot for for a while before we run into some big trouble. I had some sleep issues too. I was just busy. I had lots to do and no little time like very little time to actually do it. I wanted to do way more yesterday, but I was busy until 1.30 or so in the morning. Team America, mad team. Be careful, Captain. Alien creatures are often unpredictable. Unpredictable. Like this? Egg, silver. Oh, AG. <laughs> oh God. Can I... Oh, do I need to take out my... Uh, oh god. Oh god. Uh, how do I get my laser thingy out? The new items... We is that a weapon? It's already a weapon, is it? Tunnel mining pack... Packs... Deep mining space helmet... Mining... Uh, it's not really... Ooh. Ooh. Cutter! Silver edit, nice. Can I assign that to like hotkeys or so? God of gamers, thank you so much for the 10 gifted subs. Thank you. You can also mine minerals, yeah. So cool. The time has come of this, the hail time of Burgir. I'm already, have you, have you met our new friend? The bloody green screen is cutting out the salad. The, the lettuce. It's my Borgir plushie. Look at him. He's so cute. <laughs> he looks better when the green screen is not active <laughs> because it's cutting out the leaf of lettuce. Borgir. Oh, I love the jumping right now. Lead. Oh, wait. Before, maybe I should scan you. Nah. <laughs> it's a floating bun, yeah. It's a space burger and there's no gravity and that's why why the top bun is just floating. Why? You know? What is th this, by the way? Is this just some kind of path? Research that. Is oh, is this like maybe leading you to your main objective? Maybe, maybe? Hi Vasco, how's it going? I have to say I have to get used to it that it says Eon and then weapons underneath and not weapons and then Eon underneath, you know? It's a bit, for, for me on for, at first glance, it's a bit un counterintuitive. <laughs> Okay, violence sounds good. <laughs> this is fine. A switch. Let's just lock them in and starve them to death. <laughs> Medical sample tray. Wait, 
Ha! Light. Syringe. Uh, no thanks. It's gonna off you can loot fiber from those pla You can? Ooh. I don't know if what I need fiber for, you know? I guess I'll just wait for the game to tell me eventually what I could use certain things for. Cutting pliers. I like the game, guys. It looks very pretty. Nice! I found credits! I'm a rich girl. I don't rich things. <laughs> Everything went black. Uh oh. Hmm. Seems to be pretty clear right now. No one around. No pad. Is there something like a read button? I just want to read it. I don't want to like open it up again. Notes? No. Hmm. Okay. It's just an, an empty notepad then. Take... I don't see read buttons anywhere. Reminder, run. Oh, thanks. <laughs> Curious. These are United Colonies markings, but we are in Free Star Collective space. It then stands to reason that this was once a secret UC facility. Mm-hmm. Empty chunks packaging. Oh. Why did I pick that up? Oh my god, the last days. <gasps> is that some kind of Rubik's cube? A thermos! <laughs> what is this, Ellen Wake? Oh my god, the last days. The following is the opening of Camille Flammarion, 1894 work. Oh my god, the last days of the world, in which a comet is set to collide with the Earth in the 25th century, and people must come to terms with the end of the world and what that actually means. The Last Days of the World, Chapter 1. The magnificent marble bridge which unites the Rue de Rennes with the Rue de Louvre and which, lined with the statues of celebrated scientists and philosophers, emphasizes the monumental avenue leading to the new portico of the Institute. The Institute. Was absolutely black with peop people. A heaving crowd surged rather than walked along the quays, flowing out from every street and pressing forward toward the portico, long before invaded by a tumultuous throng. Some of these words I've never heard about. Um, never in that barbarous age preceding the constitution of the United States of Europe, when might was greater than right, when military de despotism? Spotism? Um, ruled the world and foolish humanity quivered in the relentless grasp of war, never before in the stormy period of a great revolution or in those feverish days which, accompanied by uh, de accompanied a declaration of war, had the approaches of the House of the People representatives or the Place de la Concorde presented such a spectacle. It was no longer the case of a band of fanatics rallied about a flag, marching to some conquest on the sword and followed by a throng of the curious and the idle, eager to see what would happen, but out but of the entire population, anxious, agitated, terrified, composed of every class of social without so, oh, I can't read composed of every class of society without distinction, hanging upon the decision of an oracle, waiting feverishly the result of the calculations which a celebrated astronomer was to announce that very Monday at three o'clock in the session of the Academy of Sciences. Amid the flux of politics and society, the Institute survived, maintaining still in Europe its supremacy in science, literature and art. The center of civilization, however, had moved westward and the focus of progress shone on the shores of Lake Michigan in North America. That was weird to read, I think. Hammer! If I had a hammer, I'd hammer it in the morning, I'd hammer it in the evening. Do -do 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 -do. Hi, Gooby. Uh, don't worry, Liz. I don't know the words either, and it's my first language. Okay, cool. Whew. Polytextile. Uncommon manufactured component. This item can be used as a component in crafting. Yoink. Yoink. A vial. So the question is, how much do we loot stuff? Molecule extractor? Hmm. I can sell it. 
I don't know if there's something like you can sell junk and you can just pick everything up and then sell all of the junk at once. Red Rover, game, come over. A coffee mug! Actually, my coffee is- my coffee mug is awfully empty, so I will have to go and get one soon. A chair. Lovely. What is this? Toxin. Common organic resource. This item can be used as a component in crafting. <laughs> Fridge bottom. Pack driver. They're storing funny things in their fridges here. In the future. Hey, wait a minute. This isn't Baldur's Gate 3. That is, uh, you, you, you've, you've seen correctly. Your observation skills are... 10 out of 10. <laughs> Welcome in. Hey, new Trevor? No, new... New Trevor, right? No, retro? No, I can't. What the heck are you? I was distracted. New retro, sorry. Nutrient tissue. Scan that bastard. A heat leech. Can I? Did I scan you? Did I scan him? I'm not sure. Okay. Did you just teabag a leech? Maybe Seventh Witcher? Maybe. Sculpture. Workplace safety is everyone's job. Oh boy. <laughs> Do they think that do you think they have something like a pit boy equivalent just for Starfield? Cylinder, genetic sample bottle, blah, 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 blah. document tray. Hmm. Come on, give me the good stuff. What's this? Yeah. Give me that stuff. I'm all here for it. What's this? Cred stick? Ooh! Dig... Diggy... <laughs> I was like, dig pig. No, wait. <laughs> Diggy pig, okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I take it. <laughs> I misread. I'm tired, guys. I'm... No bully. I need coffee. Look how empty it is. See, it even says on my mug, it's gone, give more. Okay, okay, please, please be nice. <laughs> oh, let's save. Uh oh. Storage, ooh, there might be loot in here. Hello. Please no more, no more leeches. Also guys, there's a, there's a movie called Dreamcatcher. Uh, it's based on are you okay, rascal? Do you want to go through? Oh no, did I break you already? Oh. Come on, I'm giving you a push. Oh, bro, you stuck. Oh, I think he unstuck himself. Smooth. <laughs> Very smooth. Um, there's this movie called Dreamcatcher, Stephen King stuff, and... Do you guys know what they did, those, those leech alien things in Dreamcatcher? They went through a certain hole in the body. And uh, it was not pleasant. And this thing down there, the the heat leech or what it was called, that reminded me of it. Way too much. History of Xenobiology. The first several chapters of Lars Nielsen's work seem to focus primarily on the digestive system of the alien herbivores. The dissection of Dr. Lourdes's uh, latest find revealed a creature that was just as she suspected, based on the, its outward appearance, an evolution of the microscopic hydrothermal worm. But her research also suggested a species that evolved in distinct stages, possibly growing significantly as it did. So the question now remains, which version of the creature did Dr. Lourdes dissect, dissect, and what maximum size could it possibly achieve? The subsequent passages deal with Nielsen's fascination with the predatory wildlife of some unnamed world. Okay. 
Uh, credits. Thank you. And your dick pic. I'm taking that too. <laughs> and your metabolic agent thing. I too take that too. What's with your note board? No, no, notepad thing. No. Hmm. All right. I thought he would teach me some things. He looked like a like a teacher thing. Medical sample tray. Are you? Oh, there you are. Um, I feel like I might have to lower the sensitivity a little bit. Maybe after the break. I feel it's a bit too fast. Aiming is good, but I think this is just like too fast. And th by the way, guys, thank you so much, everybody, for following. We're going to play Starfield now until... Basically, end of September is my plan because I want to also play Cyberpunk when that comes out. The the DLC, that is. And we're going to do a whole new playthrough. So we have a few weeks of Starfield now on the menu. Super hyped for that. I've been waiting for this game for a long time. Oh, I hear pirates. P. The hell is going on here? Nothing. Kickapoo. Yeah. Battle meal multi pack. <laughs> what is that? Oh, yeet. <laughs> oh man, I don't want to be seen. Need to check all the all the dig diggy pigs. Yeah, we we do. All of them. Beer. Nice. <laughs> they have beer in space. Chat. We we good. What is this? A full food spice worms. That was loud. Do th do you think they heard us already? <gasps> I believe we are no longer alone. Do you think they noticed us? We fine, right? We fine. Are we fine? Easy money. I think they're shooting at you. Uh oh. Take cover. Exoskeleton damaged. Gosh, this weapon's so Okay, never mind. Is no longer a viable option. That is very true. Lost them. No, we have we've killed them. That's a difference. There seems to be more of them, and we will lose them too. That's the plan. Don't sell the diggy pigs. It's for your for your ores only. In combat, Aaron often yells, "Pew pew pew." I am not sure why. Because why not? It sounds cool, doesn't it? Where even are you, pirate? You go, you go, you go bonk. Are you shooting through the bloody plant? That is cheating, mate. Oh, 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 I, I thought... I feel pain, but I hear it is terrible. It is, yeah. Bloody. Where'd you go? Deck of cards. Okay. <laughs> Can you show me your diggy pick? Uh, and, um, we have a few in my inventory now. Hi, Digby. Hello. Liz, do you notice you auto lean if you aim while in cover? No, I don't really notice that. No. Aw, succulent. Cute. Sparkling water. Nice, I take that. <laughs> that sounds good. Full food spiced worms. Ugh. That sounds disgusting, mate. But I'm taking it. It's the food of the future, I guess. Spiced worms. Have you killed all the, the bad boys? Vasco. 
Have you helped? This contexture depends where you cover it is of course. Okay. Vending machine. Boom, pop cola added. Oh no! I just clicked on it randomly. And now I lost some credits. It is sad. Okay, where do we... We need to go this way. Have we been in here? Toilet paper. Thanks, Bethesda. Mi Toilet milk? I don't know. Well, better than nothing, right? Anything else in the bathroom? Hello? Antibiotics, treatment, tried and true medicine used to treat afflictions. Okay, you need to find antibiotics, good to know. Just knowing you, we'll have those 75 credits back in no time with all the loot. <laughs> well, I need to sell the things too, right? To get credits. Actually, I should maybe heal. Do I have stuff like aid here? AMP. A steroid based performance enhancer designed to temporarily boost leg strength. Antibiotics, but in sandwich. Restores three health. Where's the you? Oh, there you go. Come la! Uh, restores 2 health and plus 8% O2 recovery over 3 meters. <laughs> Ep <laughs> Look at this thing! It's a square apple! Oh my god. I want to eat it just because. Chunks apple packaged. Am I going to eat the package with it? Drink pack beer. With this straw? Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh bloody hell. Imagine! Imagine you, you feel like a like a child in elementary school drinking from those tetra pack thingies with the straw, but it's actually beer. Like a juice box, exactly. <laughs> it's so cute. Um, what does it do? Damage resistance for three meters. Uh minus ten oh two recovery. Oh no, my my stamina goes down. Kay, hello love, how are you? Hello, Raiders, welcome in. I hope you had a great time. If you don't know me, I'm Liz, a variety streamer from Germany. I'm living in Switzerland. We just finished Baldur's Gate 3 last stream, and today we're playing Starfield. I've been waiting for this game for a long time. I love Bethesda games. And uh, I'm having a blast so far. I'm learning still. Like, for example, I was a bit overwhelmed with the, uh, with the flight the first time because there was a guy talking and there were things shooting at me and then th so many things I was just a bit overwhelmed but we managed it so far we didn't die so we good uh, welcome in everyone it's good to see you guys uh, please go check our cage absolutely love her variety streamer usually live before me I'm um, also playing Starfield today and I was a little bit jealous of all the cool Starfield stuff you had like the cool um, cap and like a jacket and like a mouse pad or something that looked awesome or was it the mouse the mouse looked also pretty cool so everything looked very cool i found that part slightly overwhelming too super fair okay i was not the only one that's good to know spiced worms Ugh. restores four health heal paste treatment a medicated cream for treatment treating burns and frostbite used for treating afflictions okay med pack restores three percent health over 10 seconds Milk. <laughs> Snack pack. Chocolate bites. Restores two health. I'm just eating me health myself healthy right now. How about like a normal med med kit? Is there nothing like a med kit? Sparkling water. Two health. Actions used minus. Mm, did I did I just miss it? Or is is this already it? Restores three percent health for ten seconds. Hmm. Isn't the scanner looting? I wish there was a mod to color the value of the item. <laughs> Why do you keep seeing three meters? Minutes! Oh, because I'm stupid and tired. Three minutes. <laughs> Where do I say three meters? Oh, because because in German, three this is this is how you say meters. This is how you say it in short. The met the, the metric system. Three M is three 
meters, and if you want to say minutes, you say you type M I N. That's how we Europeans do it, you know. So I'm like, my brain, like, I know that what it means, but I'm just de defaulting to what I know, you know. Like, I, in my head, it's minutes, but I say meters. Don't ask me why. I'm just like, I, I need more of this bean juice, you know. <laughs> um. That is 3% of my health. This green bit is 3% of my health, ladies and gentlemen. Hi, Vasco. Hi, H20, hello. It was like with your hand on your forehead. Same in Australia and New Zealand. <gasps> Vacuum tape. Oh, it's not duct tape anymore co in the future. Nothing is beyond our reach when we work together. <laughs> Win. Oh man, that was the best. Classic United Colonies. Put something in a cage until it kills you. <laughs> One more time. You keep on watching that while I loot this place, okay? A bowl, okay. Coffee mug. Wee. A pillow! Oh, I can't steal a pillow. I'm a little bit sad. Yellow flighted dart. Can I actually use it as ammunition? Hmm. Doesn't really say anything about it. Notebook. A blankie. A humidifier. <laughs> All the things. A cooler. Red harvest wheat and grapes. Oh, grapes. <gasps> Guys, we found the next dick pig. <laughs> a safe. Fill in all open slots in every layer to open the lock. Select a key and rotate it until it lines up with the g gaps in the security layer. Slot the key to fill the gaps. Each key can only be used once. What? How? So these needs need to go in, right? But this one doesn't work. Maybe I could. I think I just haven't figured out really like what they meant. Like, I could use this one and this one. Can I use two at once? Aha. Uh -huh. And now... Uh-oh. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, I see. What is that? Oh, it's credits, okay. Thank you. So this is the, the, the new lock picking. Desktop sphere toy. <laughs> um, bye, X, X Dragonborn. Thank you so much. Jimada, thank you very much for the eight month reset with Prime. Thank you. Thank you so much. That's a that's a cute way to pick locks now. I like that they come came up with something new. Oh the lighting. I love it. Hello. Coffee mug. Oh, the game is trying to tell me something, I tell you. Game is like, Liz, you need you need more caffeine in your system. Choco food! A vial. A blender base? Do I need that? Well, so far I seem to be good, right? Oops. For 
Nope, okay. It, it was lighting up, so I figured maybe... Maybe I have to scan it, but... Hmm. Battle meal multipack. Hell yee! All the schnecks! Starlocked board game. Do you think you can actually play those games? Or is it just like a to fill the, the world snack pack? When I see snacks, I'm I'm on board. Recycle. Hi Jamada, hello. Desktop diggy frame. Mine. I'm gonna put that into my spaceship. Thank you. Tape measure. Bandages. Oh yeah, that seems to be a good idea. <laughs> Thank you. A dinner plate. More foods. Your turn to do the dishes, dumbass. <laughs> Sealed container. Alrighty. Let's go after those pirates. Okay, I can't go in there. What computer are you using to run the Starfield? My computer. Ammo case? What did I click to get here? What? <laughs> Hello? Oh shit. Okay, we have two... Two pirates that I can see. They don't seem to see me. I don't see more, so maybe... Do you have something like a throwable? Hmm. Oh, you wanted to know what my computer has for hardware? Oh, okay. Wait. Oh, here we go! Hey, yo! Pirate rating pack? What is a pirate rating pack? Hang on, can I heal? Like, can I eat a million cheese wheels while I'm shooting? Um, how many met? Do I have 12? No way. Thank you. Crap, there's one there. Oh no, watch out for your exterior. Oh boy, there's two, okay. Um, um, this is a shitty position. Okay, I'm running over there. I try my bestest. Thank you. Yeah, you're getting out of here permanently. There you go. Wasn't there another one over there? Uh huh. I need a. I could use a better weapon, you know. C could you go all the way? Vasco! Vasco, move it! <laughs> you chunky robot. Oh god, there's another one? How many are there? Bloody hell. Maybe I should try the other weapon. Hex base weapons all the way on the top. Maybe this one? Magazine rounds, accuracy, range, fire rate. Is there no damage? Oh, physical 11. Four. Hmm. Meh. Okay, we're sticking with the eons, I guess. You appear to be prioritizing our deaths over your own survival. <laughs> Thanks. No, you're not. Are you dead already? Oh crap. Why did she explode? Did I actually hit her, her, her air tank? <laughs> Spacesuit. 
Ooh, what's this? Oh. It's a robot killable. Why would you kill Vasco, though? What's wrong with you? Why would you kill him? He's like Cotsworth, but just on legs. Although, yeah, well, he's not like uh, that cute. Like, Cotsworth is cutest robot, isn't he? Pharmaceutical lab. A seal and common organic resource. This item can be used in component crafting. Uh, fiber, fiber. I'm not gonna say what I just read there. We're just gonna move on. Oh, I could use more of these stim pack thingies. Sample bottle. Yeah, guys, we still have a giveaway open. Oh, I found another one of those, chat. <laughs> the diggy pigs. Okay, this is where we need to go. Although, I guess this is the door to get there. Are these showers? I guess, huh? Oh, man. Can they kill him? Mm, I don't think so, no. Usually Bethesda companions are invincible, aren't they? Oh, there's another one of the med packs. Let's go. Heart plus? What? Peekaboo. You're so loud. Vasco, come on. You need to be more sneaky sneaks. Granted, thank you for the 20 month resub. Almighty Todd, please add more health packs. <laughs> My head! <laughs> Classic! My head! Oh, level up, level up, ooh, level, 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 level up. Epic level up music! Dun dun dun. Nice, first level up shot. That's a cool. My head! <laughs> Imagine you get shot in the face and you're just surviving that and you're like, oh my head. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> oh, no! Hang on, let me just reload real quick. Hang on, I'm almost there. I'm almost ready. Ah. Is there more coming from the ceiling? You son of a gun, I wasn't ready yet. How dare you? I'm having so many males from. Uh, thingies already. Medical sample tray. What the? What is that? Oh, oh, we doing? Ooh, we do oh, these are like lock picks. Diggy ah, pick oh, okay. Things things are making sense now. So we have. Um, maybe this one. And then this one. This one, and then this one. I like that. I think that's a cool way to lockpick stuff. Unpredictable. What's that sound? Hayden wins project terminal. Okay, we're gonna check that on in a second. Give me that. Soil box. Frag grenades and fragmentation mines. Noise! Reminder, survival! Earlier they reminded us to run, now they remind us to survive. I, I like these. These are very 200 IQ advice in space. Yup. Does it say how many I have? Auto you can auto slot? Where's the fun in that? Ain't gonna happen. Um, I think this... This could work, but do we have... Maybe this one, huh? I wanna see- yeah, this works. This 
one and then okay. mine mine common manufactured component this item can be used as a component in crafting and scouts scouts rattler Ooh, new weapon nice all right let's let's save and then we go into the terminal Starware cr operating system. Really? This is his background? War, phase two, stalkers, heat leeches. I want to learn about those first. Hayden Wynn, senior xenobiologist, Crete Research Facility. Uh, May 1st, 2308. Wow. Uh, throughout the settled systems from civilized worlds to backwater bush towns, pilots have had to deal with the nuisance known commonly as the heat leech. I had my own unpleasant experience with four, four years ago at the new Atlantis spaceport. My transport was delayed while the deck crew removed a few of these filthy little things from the aft thrusters. They're attracted to heat, feed off it through some endothermic process, so thrusters are the perfect place for them to hide. They can take a full afterburner burst with no ill effects. No ill effects on the heat leeches. That is, a ship with an infestation can generally expect a 3-5% to 5 drop in thruster efficiency. Working with the heat leeches has been interesting, if not entirely satisfying. We have 11 of them in the lab, and by all accounts they're completely innocuous save for their heat siphoning properties but what if there were if what if there were a way to weaponize them perhaps artificially enhance their heat siphoning to completely and instantly disable a ship or even better to somehow reverse the process so that they transfer their own heat into a ship someday today i fear we lack the means to do either okay Rory, thank you very much for the 11 month resub. And Pumpkin, thank you so much for the six months. Thank you guys. It's actually pretty cool. Hi, Kiri, welcome in. Uh, they age well, I enjoy the emotes. All right. Uh, do, 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 do. We've officially stopped work on the stalkers. There are enough creatures in the field to serve the red devils who haven't been here to train in over a year. If they need more, we can easily gather some from the planet and fit them with NCIs. But from this point on, our focus is phase two. Oh, nice, phase two. It's finally time. After a number of successful missions with the red devils, the stalkers have proven to be exactly the weapons we had hoped for. So it's time to expand our operations. Mast has finally approved the next stage of this facility's operations, Project Pet Shop. Phase two will now commence. And now about the war. We are at war. War. War never changes. By establishing the colony of Vesta, the Freestock Collective have forced the UC's hand. The unmitigated Gel, thinking they could establish control over a fourth star system, such a flagrant violation of the Treaty of Narian, our diplomats tried to resolve this peacefully, but the Council of Governors wouldn't listen to reason. Apparently, they claimed that Vesta was not a colony, but rather just an insignificant farming outpost. Nice try. By all accounts, the Red Devils and Stalkers worked in perfect unison, and the results were everything we could have hoped for. No Red Devil or Stalker casualties. Vesta's defenders were apparently taken by complete surprise, which greatly contributed to their fatality rate, 93%. This is a great day for the Red Devils, as great, a great day for the United Colonies and a great day for Xeno Warfare. Note, no, it's not lost on me that this classified facility is actually located within Freestar Collective Space, so goes the great game. <laughs> okay. Alrighty, um... My dear friends, we will continue here after a short break, okay? I just realized that I am 45 minutes over my usual break time already and I, I need a coffee really bad. I will just take a break and make coffee and then I will run like a crazy person back to my PC to continue this. I'm having so much fun. I enjoy this a lot. Of course, for me personally, it's always like the first two hours or so or maybe three or maybe the first, depending on how long the game is. Let's say the first 
10% of the game I'm still learning and like overwhelmed a little bit here and there. The more complex the game is, the longer it takes usually. So there will be things where I'm like, uh, what's going on? What do I have to do? But it plays a lot like the beloved Bethesda games that we know, right? Like Skyrim and Fallout. And I haven't encountered any bugs yet, I would say. Not to my knowledge, everything was fine. And it's running very smooth, so I'm very happy with this. And so far it's like just fun to play and shoot and explore and loot and you know, just the just the normal things. So I hope you enjoy this as well.